One item you're going to need is this hammer here or something similar to it. You can use a claw hammer um, or a ball peen hammer, but this here is a dead blow hammer. And the nice thing about this one is it's rubberized. So when I hit the tripod with it, it doesn't um, mar the surface. So if you have something rubberized like this, it's probably be best to use. Um, if not, you can just like maybe put a little cloth around the tripod and then hit it with your claw hammer. The other item you're gonna need is an Allen key, such as this one here. I believe it is one eighth. So basically you're concerned with removing the screws that are underneath this little uh, boot or sleeve, I don't know what you wanna call it. But you take this little rubber covering down just like this and there's two screws under there and you should just like jack it up a little bit okay so you take your allen key and you just loosen that up and these are not very tight so it shouldn't it shouldn't be hard to loosen it really shouldn't take a lot of effort and there's one on the other side too on the back side there's one so after you take out the Allen key uh, screws, the next thing you're going to want to do is actually turn the, the, the head so that it comes off of the tripod. So you have to turn it counterclockwise, but I'm going to show you what happens when you do that in some cases. So here I am trying to remove the head here. So you're going to grab it here. You can grab it wherever you want. You know, you just want to hold it and, and try to turn it off. But first you're gonna to wanna to tighten this down. So tighten the pan screw so that the, so that the head cannot turn anymore. And then try to turn it off. So sometimes it's a little hard to come off. It doesn't really wanna budge. So in a past life, I used to be an auto mechanic. And one thing that I learned from doing that job is whenever you have something that's a little tight and it needs a little persuasion, there's nothing like hitting the hell out of it with a hammer. That will loosen up most things. So what you're gonna do, you're supposed to be twisting counterclockwise. So basically what you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna wanna hit it right there a couple of times. So just give it a couple of taps. And basically that should loosen it up enough so that you can just twist the whole head off.